back, y'all. Today I'm back in my parents' place, uh, kind of north of the Atlanta metro area, and i um, here to do, I'm gonna help out around their place, and one of the things we're gonna do, we're gonna check up on my mom's um, collection of heritage hens out here, and I'm gonna install this automatic gate for her. So I have some implements here in the van. Um, it looks like my parents and the boys are about to head back there. So we're gonna bring this stuff back there and we'll check up on all the chickens and then we'll um, discuss the plan for our, our little gate here. All right, so here we are, my parents' barn here, and here's a couple of them. Let's see, was that one of the leg bars, Mom? Have any of them jumped the fence? No. Is see that the, a leg bar? See the blue ear? No, 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 this is a silky. Silky, right. Oh, They have yeah. a blue fluorescent ear. Yeah, look at that. Isn't it crazy? That's cool. That's their ear? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Look at those feet, though. So there's the other silky right there. Uh, yeah. And they're, they're Hey, not... girls. Last keep, time... They last keep time... putting themselves in danger. Last time we were here, they wouldn't Mom even come out of the... Up. The cage. Where are the rest One of them? One is walking up. Come out of the coop. Because I put some... But as soon as you... Up. Oh, there they are. Hey, girls. How okay. you doing? Don't drop here on the perch. Oh, that's where they sleep at night. Where? Up on the perch. Here, baby, let me take George. Yeah. They're looking good. Are we getting any eggs yet? Uh, uh, this time, uh, birds has a good, uh, getting their, their, their breast and top of their head is getting red. That means they're kind of Gotcha. Okay. So another month, maybe? Yes, that's what we Okay. Hello. How are you doing, huh? Like, where are my treats? Oh, they do like the watermelon. Oh, okay. I forgot to bring the little watermelon. So, so the, three, make it in our the three light colored girls are hmm, opal leg bars. Opal leg bars. And then, and then you had the other leg bar. Cream leg bar. And then there's one cream leg bar. Cream leg bar. That cream. must be. Uh, she might be outside here. Okay. Black, solid black ones or black astrolorps. Ostrodorps. That's their safe spot up there. And then the speckled ones, see one in the sunshine there. The barb, barb yeah. rocks. Barb rocks. Have you caught anything in here yet with them? Caught anything? Really. You know, like like pests. We had a predators. Um, I don't know how it got in here, but we had a barn swallow flying around in here. Oh. I have no idea how it got in. Well, that's not going to be much of a threat to the chickens, though. No, no, no. Yeah. I, I got them out quick. Yeah. Huh. Cool. I wonder how it got in here. And then those are Rhode Island Reds, the ones with the black tails. All right, cool. So where, where, where are we putting the door? Right over here, and it can be anywhere, so obviously between the studs. And yeah, I see the studs, yeah. So, you know, what I'm thinking is if it hits up here, if it starts here, uh -huh. I need a little bitty, you know, two steps to go up here. Uh-huh. And so there's a four by four plywood in here that we can cut down if you can. I think it was like a door. Okay, where are you got some lumber in here somewhere? Because I think it's pretty important. What's this? Yeah. This to keep them out? Keep them out of the rest they make of the a mess over here? Well, they'll roost on absolutely oh, everything. Oh, yeah, right. So pooping everywhere. Poop on everything. So let's see. There's the four by four. Okay. So you get the lights on. and. Here's some stuff too. Yeah, I'll get the lights on. Look at that light. It's really bright. Like deck boards over here. It looks like that's what they made the the uh, walls of these stalls out of. Oh, there we go. That's a good light. I think we're gonna want to use this. What's that? This stuff. That's fine too. Yeah. All right. I think plywood's gonna warp. Well, it'll be out of the rain. Okay. So, True. all right, I'm gonna put the camera down and come up with a plan. All right. So I think we have a plan here. We're gonna mount. We're gonna mount the door under here. Probably right about here, and then it's gonna come out um, under the little carport area there, where my dad keeps his tractor. Right over here. Might have to move the tractor. Let's see. 
So yeah, it'll come out maybe like right there. And there's a void in this wall between the outer siding and the, um, like this inner siding that they have in these stalls here. So we're gonna have to make some kind of, you know, it's, there's like a four inch void in there. We're gonna have to make a little walkway in there too for it. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm sure this door came with like a template of some kind for the cutout that we need to make. So I'm gonna find that and we'll go ahead and draw that on the wall here and get the inner wall cut out and then mark to cut the outside um, and then rough fit it in place and see, see how it goes, see what it looks like. Okay, so this gate is solar uh, charged. So we need to make sure that this panel right here can mount on the front of the barn and reach where we want to install the door in here. So we might not be able to go as far back into the coop as we were hoping. Yeah, we're probably gonna need to do it like right here. Okay. So, or maybe right here even. Sure. Yeah. Will it reach? Do we have yeah, an extra, we have do we have slack? Okay, yeah. great. So it's, we're gonna do it right here. We're just gonna do it one stud closer than we originally uh, planned. All right, so we have our template drawn out on the wall right here. I don't know if you can see that in pencil, but we're gonna use this uh, big long drill bit to drill a pilot hole. And then we're gonna use our sawzaw here to cut it out. And then we'll have to do the same thing for the other side. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get started on that. Got our rough uh, cut out there. That's the inside. And then the outside, I'll show you all is where we're gonna mount this gate. Unfortunately, we have this lap siding here, so it's not gonna mount flush. We're probably gonna have to caulk it or something, but you can see it'll mount just like this. Right like that. And then we'll just nail it right to the siding there and uh, hook up all the electronics. There we go. This isn't gonna work. Okay, so we're on hour three here of the installation. The big hang up here is that we had the wall inside, uh, the stall wall inside, and then we had this lap siding. And when we installed this originally, well, first we installed it. See, this door has to come up. Yeah, hold on, hold it right there. The door has to come up out of the back of this. And when we installed it originally, we did it like that. Yeah, which so defeated the whole purpose. Couldn't even get out of there. So, so then, then we, we installed it like this, and it came up and hit the next so piece of siding. So it only opened this much. Right. So we finally built this little frame here, yeah. which actually looks better anyways. Yeah. And then we'll mount this uh, right on here. So let's go ahead and, and mount it. I'm excited to mount it and see if it works. Yeah. All right, I think we're finally done here. We even had to add another little piece of wood here because it still wasn't clearing the, the, the lap siding lap. here, but you can see now it works. And you can set this thing on a timer to open and close and it's also solar powered it's pretty cool so we still got to set all that stuff up but we finally got this working finally i'm stoked eh yeah all right where'd the chickens go they're in the garage where'd they go let's go see them so we have some in here and the rest of the flock we can't get in but you can see right there there's our entry point from inside and then come around they're, here. They're checking it out over here. Here's the solar panel right here. And then here's the door right here. Does anybody want to go through? Come on, girls. See that little firewood ramp works. Yeah, we use some firewood as a ramp there. Somebody go through. Come on. 
But anyways, the door finally opens. We're gonna get a silky to go through. That's not a silky. No, that's not a silky, is it? Yeah. That's the, um, the leg bar? Yeah. All right, well, they like the ramp. They can stand on the ramp at yeah, least. Yeah, the ramp seems like it'll work. Yeah. I'm gonna try to push them over that one. All right, cool. All right, well, we're gonna keep fiddling around with the hens here. Um, but there's the finished product. We have a little ramp, and the gate finally clears the lap siding here, so. Anyways, y'all, if anybody has any questions or comments about my mom's um, heritage chickens, oh, look, look. there we go. There we go. We got it on camera. It works. Yes. My mom will be excited. Good job, Oh, girls. excellent, excellent. All right, that great. That was good for them. They worked great. It works. All right, all right, y'all. If anyone has any questions or comments about these goofy hens or um, our little uh, solar automatic door here, just post down below. Till next time, everybody out there, take care. Bye.